hello everyone welcome to your channel online exam center in this particular video we will uh, describe you how to remember this particular prefixes uh, which are used for so many times uh, while studying physics math and other some um, uh, subjects in which these are used for so many times okay uh, these quantities are also used in uh, uh, just by english words some of the english words are there for that particular quantities and here we will learn how to remember this one okay first of all i am going to tell you that uh, here you can see the value uh, deci deca okay so here you can see this is deci and this is deca this deci and deca is having some uh, special values here uh, when you will write 10 having power 0 okay so th uh, this has the value 1 okay uh, this is not uh, the one is not having any particular uh, what i say prefixes this is just having only zero but when we uh, goes down goes up then we say uh, here you can see 10 to power minus 1 is noted by deci 10 to power minus 2 is by centi 10 to power minus 3 is by milli 10 to power minus 6 is by micro the micro is 10 for 10 to power minus 6 and it is represented by this sign mu and uh, here you can see the nano uh, nano is uh, uh, represented by a small n and it, it is having value 10 to the power minus 9. Pico is having 10 to the power minus 12 value. Mostly the uh, femto, here femto used for generally finding the radii of uh, nucleus of uh, any atom. So this is uh, 10 to the power minus 15. This is also known as one for me. Okay. The later quantities are not used for so many times, but still you should know about the value of uh, these quantities and also the notation and the prefixes. The most important things are the initial six okay initial six are very much important uh, in downside and in upside also in upside when you will go then you will see the deca deca is mean 10 to power 1 and uh, we in uh, general language also says 10 as a deca okay we consider 10 as a deca so you should remember this one hecto is 10 to power 2 and kilo uh, kilo is being used for so many multiple times even in general day uh, general use we also use kilo and it is having 10 to the power 3 that's why we say uh, the 10 to the power 3 that means 1 kilo is having uh, uh, 1000 gram that is 1000 you can see here okay the mega mega in terms uh, 10 to the power 6 and the giga uh, 10 to the power 9 and tera is having uh, the value 10 to the power 12 and it is denoted by the capital t uh, here the quantities which are going upside is mostly denoted by the uh, capital uh, words of alphabet okay and a peta is uh, 10 to power 15 here and exa jepta and yota these are all higher quantities okay so when you will go to see these are uh, smaller than one okay sorry uh, they, these are okay these are having value less than one but greater than zero 10 to power minus one is having less than well one value okay when you are increasing from uh, downside to upside then the value of quantity is also increasing okay when you are going from down to upside the value of quantity is also increasing uh, and uh, here you can see the smallest value is yokto and the largest value is yotta and how uh, you will remember this one okay sometimes the english words are there for uh, these particular quantities okay deca is also called it 10 one is also called as one and deci is called as 10th okay then centi is called as 100th any yani one one matlab 10th uh, uh, piece 100th piece yani uh, the part of that particular key, any quantity, the hundredth part is that uh, centi, okay. The same way thousandth, millionth is represented in this way, okay. But uh, these are not used mostly. Uh, the mostly used quantities when we are talking about money are this, ten, thou uh, hundred, thousand, million. Million is used for here, you can see 10 to power 6, okay. 10 to power 5 is lakh and 10 to power 6 is 10 lakh. So, 10 lakh is called uh 1 million okay later on when will uh, uh, the name is increased that it goes to the billion okay 10 to the power 9 is called billion again uh it goes to the trillion 10 to the power 12 is called trillion okay the, the uh, other higher quantities are there but uh, mostly we uh, never use uh while studying these things but uh, if you do know uh, you you can also remember these quantities uh, these quantities were adopted in particular years uh, 10 was adopted in uh, 1795 this is a uh, long year before uh, uh, the even thousand was adopted uh, long year before but million comes after uh, 100 year and uh, thereafter 100 year uh, comes a billion and uh, other higher quantities okay and uh, these uh, very high quantities 
uh, where uh, included in adoption is 1991, 1991, 1975. But uh, these are not uh, very important from our point of view. Now we will go to uh, what I said the trick about this particular quantity. How do we remember this one? When you will go to see uh, from starting here, you can see this is uh, here. You can see this is uh, one. We will start from here, and you will pronounce like this: deci deca. You will say first of all deci, then deca. You knows the value of deca that is ten, so deci will have value ten to power minus one. Just uh, the power will just have a opposite sign. Again, we will go to remember centi hecto, centi hecto, and milli kilo, milli kilo micro mega the important thing is the pronunciation okay then again nano giga nano giga uh, comes in rhythmic process so you can remember this one also nano giga similarly pico tera and femto pita auto exa jepto jetta yotto and yotta okay yotto and yotta so you can remember in this way okay uh, how the multipliers how the powers is increasing you can see from 10 to power 0 you can see here the power increased by 1 and here goes down by minus 1 so counting as you uh, as the running is start we, we start counting from 0 1 2 3 okay 1 2 3 then go then go round will after 3 that will start increasing in the multiples of 3 3 2 are 6 3 3 is a 9 3 4 is a 12 3 5 is a 15 3 6 is a 18 3 7 is a 21 and 3 8 is a 24 in the same way it will go in downs so as you remember the uh, deci deca centi hecto milli kilo micro mega nano giga pico tera femto pita atto exa zepto jetta yotto yokta then you can remember the values of this particular quantities also okay so sometimes some questions are asked what is the value of 1 million what is value of 1 billion so you must remember these two things also okay this 10 to power 6 is 1 million okay and 10 to power 9 is 1 billion and 10 to power 12 is 1 trillion so you remember these particular things also okay now uh, i am going to show you how uh, you can remember this one as we are just pronouncing this one you can see here this is uh, 1 2 3 then after counting is starting in the multiple of 3 3 2 ja 6 3 3 ja 9 3 4 ja 12 3 5 ja 15 3 6 ja 18 7 ja 21 and 8 ja 24 okay so 1 2 3 then after counting is in started in multiples of 3 so this is same thing is happening here now when you will remember this one deca is having value 10 so deci is having value 10 to power minus 1 hecto is having value 10 to power plus 2 so the centi is having value this one so you remember in this way deci deca centi hecto milli kilo micro mega nano giga pico tera femto pita auto exa zepto jetta yocto and yotta so if you if you remember this procedure then you can find the value of multiplier also this is enough for today's video and uh, we will come with the next trick in next video so for such tricks and such uh, what i say best way to learn something subscribe our channel like this video and share this video with other of your friends so they can remember this particular trick also thanks for watching this video